Hi, I'm Rachel. Welcome to Slow Fashion Mom. Today I will be doing the in and out tag video and I was tagged by Patricia Keel. I will link her channel down below. So the basic idea behind the in and out rule is that when you purchase something new or bring something into your house, then one item has to go out. And I love this rule and I find it essential to keeping a clutter-free home. We've been trying to really stick to this rule in our house, especially since we began kind of our minimalism journey. And, you know, especially since decluttering, I find this rule just helps us keep on track and keep our place clutter-free. So I love this rule and I'm going to show you a few things that I have recently applied it to. So the first thing is makeup and I have been slowly switching all my makeup to green, beauty, um, all natural, eco-friendly, all of that. So I recently picked up this Mineral Fusion eyeshadow and I love it. It's got kind of a taupey color, a light and then a dark. It's really great for fall and winter and you can do a natural day look and a smoky eye. So I'm happy with that. What it is replacing is this Naked 2 palette. And this palette has six shadows. It's missing one that I broke, but I really keep a minimal makeup collection and I like a minimal makeup look. So this was always way too many shadows for me. I can get all the looks I need with these three colors. This is one of the last toxic products that I've been hanging on to. I don't know about you, but it's sometimes hard for me to get rid of something I've paid a lot of money for. <laughs> Anyways, this will be gone. The second thing I've purchased recently is also non-toxic beauty. It's a mascara by Mineral Fusion. I've tried a few natural mascaras which have been okay, but this one is really great and it really works well for me. I love it. So I will be getting rid of this Lancome mascara. This is also one of those things that I've been holding on to. I received it as a gift for my birthday in April and it's amazing. I love it. But yeah, it's one of those toxic beauty items. And so I don't feel quite so bad getting rid of this because you're supposed to replace your mascara anyway after six months. And it's been six months now. Also because I found something I like to replace it, it's not so bad. The next thing is a piece I thrifted for my fall wardrobe. It's just a cotton scarf with a little bird print on it. <laughs> So I got this to replace my absolute favorite scarf of all time. I'm actually quite sad to see this go. I, I love this print. It looks awful up close. It's just pulled and snagged and it's time. It was a cheap purchase from a fast fashion brand maybe four or five years ago and yeah, it has bit the dust. <laughs> and the last thing I wanna show you today is this cutting board. <laughs> So not too exciting, it's just a bamboo cutting board from Ikea, but our old plastic cutting board just is in horrible shape. I'm kind of embarrassed to show this on camera, but yeah, it just looks awful and I'm happy to see that go. I'm hoping it can be recycled. I don't think I would ever buy a plastic cutting board again, they just don't hold up. But I'm very happy with the bamboo one so far it should last for a really long time and if it doesn't it's a natural material so it can biodegrade so that's it for today i just wanted to quickly show you some things i have applied the in and out rule to in our life recently i would like to tag Levy from at home with Levy for this video and thanks so much for watching today if you like it please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you'd like to see more i'll see you next time bye